Hi everyone, welcome to Patty's Polish Corner. Today is Skyleen's um, birthday collab, and that's Skyleen of Skyleen325. And let's see, um, some of us got together and we created some special mammies for her. Um, there, some of them um, have videos, some of them might not. Um, but if they do have a video, I will put the link in the description box below as soon as I um, receive it. Um, we'll show you all the pictures coming up. Um, mine will be the last one. And I'll show you how I created it. Um, Gailene, I hope you like my video. I was thinking of you when I created this Manny because I know you are like the water marble queen. So let's get started. I'm going to tell you, I'm going to show you what I'm going to use for this Manny. Ta-da! Water marble plate. Did you guys think I was actually going to do water marbles? <laughs> nah, no. Um, but I got this awesome What's Up Nails water marble plate. And I haven't used it yet, so I'm going to use it. For my um, base coat, I'm going to use Yes Sure Gel Polish. And it's a mood gel. Of course, we have wave gels, shiny no clean top gel, and base gel. I think Eileen's favorite color is blue, um, so that's why I'm using these colors today. And this one is a beautiful light blue, and I think it turns almost to a white. I use this a lot in the winter um, because it just makes a really pretty mani. So I'm going to put this on all of my nails, cure it, and come back. Okay, um, so now I'm going to put it on the second coat. And then I'm going to cure this and come back. Okay, so I have two coats, and you can kind of tell it's, it's kind of warm right now. It's not as bright blue as it was before from the bottle. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to remove the tacky layer and get ready for stamping. And the stamping polish I'm going to use today is from Twinkled Tea and it's called Clickbait. I'm going to use my favorite Queen um, stamper from Walmart. I'm going to use this image right here. Okay, click pick, click bait appears to be a little on the sheer side, but it looks really great um, with this color. I really love it. I probably should have put some liquid latex on, but I did not. And someday I will do a water marble, but not your conventional water marble. I'll do um, one of those veil ones. I just, there's no way on earth I'm going to be um, putting 100 dots of polish in water and stick my finger in there. <laughs> not going to happen. But I am thankful that somebody created these awesome stamping plates for those of us who don't want a water marble. I'm really kind of loving this plate. It's pretty awesome. OK, 
Okay, and here is the last one. All right, so I'm gonna clean this mess up because I should have put liquid latex on. And then we're gonna come back and we're gonna look at it all cool and we'll look at it all warm. So I'll be right back. Oh, we gotta put top coat on too. Okay, so now I'm gonna add the top coat. We'll add the top coat and then I will come back. Okay, so here they are when they're cold. All right, and now I'm going to heat them up. And here they are when they're warm. So here is the finished look. Happy birthday, Gailene. Does my water marble look just as good as yours? <laughs> Okay, everybody, if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. If you're not one of my subscribers, please subscribe. Thank you for watching. Bye for now.